How y'all doing? It's Frank. I'm here again um, with Academy of Hope. They wanted me to talk about uh, my spring break and how it was and what I did. Um, I want to start off by saying I was supposed to take my GED test, but I didn't feel too comfortable about this. I, I kind of was like, let me relax, take this spring break to you know get myself together. On top of that, my wife has been going bananas with cleaning and she's in the last trimester of her uh, pregnancy. It's called the nesting stage. Um, she's just, you know, she's been going bananas with buying things and cleaning and, you know, putting stuff together. So my spring break was, you know, revolved around, you know, just everything dealing with the baby. But um, after that, you know, I did prepare myself mentally to come back and, you know, just go straight forward so that way I can get this GD and walk across that stage and accomplish the goal that I set in 2017 to accomplish. My big struggle area with the math is geometry. I can't never remember the formula. Um, the good thing about on the GD test, they give you this formula um, little click button. You can click on it and let's say you need the cone formula. You click on the formula sheet, you go down and you see cone, you can jot it down, then go back to the questions. Sometimes they give you like some numbers, then you can plug it in and figure out what you need or what they asking you for, which that is real helpful. Um, I'm just really looking forward to taking this text next week because hopefully I pass it this time so I can go past the real test. So wish me luck. I'm being very... Uh, optimistic <laughs> about it <laughs> if i pronounce that word right but y'all get what i'm saying i'm feeling very excited about it back to school we go um i only have one test left to take and that's the math so i've been really uh getting it in you know math is a difficult subject and this is the reason why i didn't pass it in 2005. yes i've been at this since 2005 trying to receive my GED. You know, it was such a disappointment the first go around. And, um, you know, I, I gave up. I just couldn't do it. it. You know, it just really had me down. Like, I, you know, I just was self, I was doubting myself so much about the math. So I decided to give up on it. And uh, so in 2014, I tried to go back to classes once again, to um, receive my GED, and it just didn't work out for me. You know, the journey is long, the journey is a struggle, but without that difficult journey, you know, life wouldn't be what it is.